Hey what's going on guys Tanmay here and welcome to my channel and as you can see on this table we have a tripod situation let's talk about tripods and all the different types of tripods and which tripod is more suitable in which situation i've got them all on this table and uh, don't ask me why i own all these this was my quest to find one particular tripod that would suit all the situations but in that quest you can see i've definitely failed and now i have these bunch of tripods that i have extensively used so i'm going to do a big comparison between all these tripods and this video is for anyone and everyone who is wanting to buy a tripod or a selfie stick uh, let's say you're traveling let's say you want to do videography photography you want to do videos like this where you have your camera set up on a tripod or you you know you want to do hiking and traveling and you want a travel tripod etc etc you want to take group selfies all those things so you want to invest in a good tripod but you are confused as to which one is the best suitable for you so i have you covered guys i have you can see uh, around 7 tripods and a additional bonus at the end of this video so we're going to talk about all these things in detail in this video so make sure you watch this video till the end and with that being said let's get started Now before we start talking about these tripods individually in case if you are interested in making a purchase in buying any of these tripods uh, all the links are there in the video description i've shared them and you guys can check it out i've pretty much bought all of them via amazon and they they might be available or unavailable so i've also shared some alternatives and some good other options so these are my associate links affiliate links and in case if you make purchase via these links it also helps me and grow grow this channel as well so that would be great and apart from that i will share uh, the critical details of individual tripods like you know the height the minimum and maximum height the weight and the payload that it can carry as well as the model number in the form of in infographics in in case if i miss them uh, in case if i uh, miss talking about them you will of course see them on the screen and with that being said let's start off with the big big one over here the elephant in the room the main photo studio tripod so this one is Uh, by a company called Digitech, and uh, I think the model name is uh, Digitech DPTR 880 Pro. Yeah, so that that is the model name. Of course, you will see it on the screen. And this one, as you can see, is definitely uh, a bulky tripod. It is around three to four kilos, I guess. And this is definitely not a travel tripod. Okay, so this is the minimum height, uh, the minimum folded version. You can see. and uh, this goes up to 5.4 feet which is approximately my height so it comes at my height and uh, this is mostly used in a stationary situation which means that it is used in a photography studio or a videography studio or shooting videos like this which is like you know uh, sitting videos or videos which are shot at home you're not going to take this on your travel trips you're not going to take this much hiking in case if you have luggage space in your car you can of course toss it in there but this is mostly used in a stationary scenario okay so one of the unique feature that this particular tripod has is this handle that it comes along with and it has this top to bottom and left to right panning motion i will show you b rolls of what exactly i'm talking about and it also has that tension adjustment At, uh, which you can use to you know adjust how strong or how force how much force you want in case you want to do the panning motion right so in case if you are shooting a b roll of a particular product you know if you are doing product videography let's say you are doing a videography of a mobile and you want to do a left to right pan you can use this handle you can you know mount your camera on the top and you can do a left to right pan in a very smooth fashion you can see i'm doing this in a very smooth way similarly you can go from top to bottom like this and this gives a extra smooth movement and that very crisp b roll look okay so this is one unique feature that it has and of course it will extend it has these extendable legs which you simply pop open like this and you know the legs extend out so it has i guess three extension legs So this is the one actually unfolded already, and then we have two more extensions, and the maximum height is five point five feet. So yeah, this one is definitely mostly used in home situations. As I said, I use this at my home, 
and uh, in case if you're wondering if this is over here what am i exactly uh, mounting my camera on then just to give you a view about what exactly i've done so i have this light stand onto which i have mounted two lights and then there is my dji pocket to camera which i have hooked up onto this mount okay so i've done some extra work because i'm running out of tripods right all my tripods are basically on on this platform over here on this table so that's why i've mounted my camera and the light onto that light stand itself all right so this was the first tripod the big one the elephant in the room let's let's get it done with i'll just you know keep it like this so that we can focus on the next one now the next tripod is this table top tripod so this is having these tripod legs which are metallic legs this is by polum photo and the model name is h9 this is definitely a very sturdy tripod but this is my least favorite one probably because i own the others and you know they have replaced this one i initially purchased this with the thought that you know i can fold it out and i can use it for vlogging a uh, good feature it has is it has this extension pole if you unscrew this you know i can extend out a little bit so you can see the minimum height and maximum height on the screen and then it also has this ball head which is actually a little flimsy you have you have to loosen it and you know you can do the 180 degree rolling and even 90 degree in case if you are you know wanting to shoot portrait videos and photos like this so this is how it goes but this is a little flimsy it's not very fluid and uh, i don't really use this this is the least used tripod that i have this is a table top tripod which means that it needs a flat surface so you have to pull out all the three legs and you know you can put it on the table and you can loosen this get the feet down and now you have a proper table top tripod now this is a very sturdy tripod so this can definitely take on uh, weights of dslrs as well and you know some heavy cameras not just your small phones and gopros and all this can take dslrs as well i think around 3 kilos is what it, it it can take on and it is definitely firm but as i said i don't really use this much so this is a simple table top tripod which you can use it at your home you can you know if you're shooting home videos sitting videos you can just put this tripod over your uh, put your smartphone onto the smartphone holder which you can see i have over here just attach your smartphone and you know now you have this amazing vlogging rig you know you can fold these legs and get that selfie distance kind of thing and now you can do the vlogging thing right so this is also giving you quite a lot of reach this is at least around 30 cm is what i can uh, guess but you can see the maximum length so this gives you enough reach to do the vlogging thing and uh, yeah this is a good tripod one more unique feature about this tripod is you can remove off the legs let me just unfold this what you guys can do is if you just unscrew this this internal monopod can be removed by you know first unscrewing this as well from the bottom there is a cap over here which can come out once you unscrew this the leg can completely come out and now what you have is this tiny monopod thing it has a quarter inch hole over here which is a standard quarter inch screw hole so you can mount it on any other tripod also so this can now act as a monopod and this is where my another tripod comes into pictures so this is the third one this is a tiny tripod leg okay so th these are just legs and it has a quarter inch screw so i can mount this over here so basically what i did is i replaced the legs okay so now this has a very tiny profile these legs are very small you can see so i'll just do a side by side comparison these are the original ones and these are the separate ones that i've bought right so you can see the size comparison now this gives it a very minimalistic profile and i can also fold the legs i can uh, use this again as a selfie stick right and in case if i want to balance it off i can do it do note that these legs are very tiny so they're not very good at balancing heavy stuff 
in that case we'll have to use the original one but i don't really like these legs these are definitely well built and metallic legs but they take a lot of space onto the table so yeah this was the second tripod the tabletop tripod and along with that we also covered this tiny tripod legs these are i think ulanzi tripod legs they they actually quite are quite expensive i think around 600 bucks and and i don't think you actually need this you'll probably only need this if you have uh, if you want to take those low ground shots right so you can attach your phone mount over here and you can put this onto the ground and take those ground shots so you know you can see i can put my phone like this and i can take a very low profile angle but i don't think you actually need it this is just an extra accessory okay so these are those tripod legs all right now let's talk about two other tripod types which are also you know converted into selfie sticks so these are the two tabletop tripods again with these three legs which can you know fold to become grip okay and both of them can be extended out so they also become a selfie stick right so these are the two so this one is polem photo uh, the model number you can see on the screen let's talk about the smaller one first so this is a very well built tripod and usually i have this in my backpack all the time it is like around 15 cm when it's completely collapsed it has this ball head which can be loosened out and you know you can mount your phone holder and it has this good screwing mechanism so that you don't have to turn your phone but you simply have to turn this screw using this mechanism and your phone mount gets easily mounted so good thought in designing then tighten the ball head and there you go again you have a small tripod rig and you can always extend this out and now you get that extra reach right you can do the vlogging thing so this is by polem photo its big brother is this ulanzi model uh, the model name you can see on the screen this is exactly what this is but in a larger form factor and i usually prefer this one because it gives me a larger reach the ball head is also much more higher quality compared to this one not that this is any bad this is always there in my pocket because it is pocketable this one this ulanzi one is not pocketable it is a little you know uh it it is definitely more than 15 cm and it also has a little bit of width to it so you can't usually carry it in your pocket you actually can if you have baggy jeans but yeah then there is one unique feature of this it has a cold shoe mount onto this side so you can mount a microphone over here or a extra light so you know i have this road video micro microphone now what i can do is i can mount this to the side and uh, let me just mount the phone holder as well so i have mounted the phone holder i have mounted the microphone to the side to this cold shoe mount which is provided by this ulanzi tripod and then i can simply slide in my phone over here and now what i have is a phone with a high quality microphone to the side and i can simply plug in this microphone and now i can vlog with high quality audio right i can also extend this if i want and now you, you can see i have a proper vlogging rig this cold shoe mount is rotatable so i can rotate this and make it point to me so even that pos that is possible and this phone holder also has a extra cold shoe mount at the top so i can have a small you know portable light over here in case if i'm vlogging in the dark so even that is great so now this is a complete vlogging rig right this is a proper vlogging rig with good high quality microphone a shotgun microphone also a light on the top in case if i'm doing that in low light and then i have my phone so this is very low profile this is much more compact you can easily carry this instead of the bulky dslrs that most vloggers do i don't know how they do it massive respect for all those big big vloggers uh, you know those those guys who are carrying those a7s and the big big full frame dslrs that's that's definitely not my cup of tea i guess but yeah this one is definitely highly recommended i use this in most of my travel trips you know in case if i have to quickly set it down on a table top i can do it i can raise the height i can do a sitting video 
this this height is more than enough for doing a sitting video it it is coming at my eye level right so there's that and you know i can put any any of the device so all these tripods have the feature that you know the top end is nothing but a quarter inch screw which can go on a smartphone holder it can go on a action cam holder this is a action cam holder right gopro gopro mount or it can also go on to your dslrs be it point and shoot be it your apsc or be it your full frame all of them have this quarter inch mount so it's very versatile and universal right okay so these were the two table top tripods which also extend out to become selfie sticks these are the two and again links of both these tripods in the video description let's keep them aside let's move forward and let's talk about a unique product on this table which is this flexible tripod so this is again a tripod with three legs but these legs are flexible in the sense that the outer coating is rubber for the grip but internally they have wire or mesh frame which makes it bendable right so these legs you can see i can completely bend them and this makes this tripod very unique because now i don't need a flat surface so far all these tripods these table top tripods they need a flat surface to balance on right but let's say i am hiking and i am in a very rugged situation where the surface is not properly balanced in that case i will have a lot of difficulty in you know trying to balance this tripod but this tripod i can easily bend the legs and i can you know make it balance any way i want right so this is one unique feature it also has this ball head which is pretty smooth and then you have your smartphone on the top right this is where you put your smartphone another unique feature is this entire ball head is replaceable it's removable you can completely remove this off and you can attach anything else that you have over here again the same quarter inch screw so this ball head you can put it on some other tripod or on another pole or extension that you have so this uh, this tripod is also called gorilla pod at times uh, the gorilla pod term was famous by the uh, was made famous by the company joby joby is another big company which makes these uh, camera accessories these tripods especially the gorilla pods which were very famous among vloggers but that is very very expensive and uh, they also have a problem that those ball heads come sometimes break off with uh, with very aggressive use or rough use and this one is definitely much more sturdy they have these internal wire frames which can easily be straightened out you can put this in your backpack this is usually there as a secondary tripod secondary travel tripod in my backpack because you know if i'm going on hiking or you know traveling somewhere where i will not get those flat surfaces in that case this helps me a lot and this acts as a secondary tripod so it's always there in my backpack uh, it's by a company named epicam which i don't think is in stock anymore but i have a cheaper version of this cheaper alternative so i have shared the link in the video description you guys can check it out all right so we have pretty much covered the six tripods and this takes me to the last tripod which is actually my favorite one and i recently got this one this one is by photo pro a company called photo pro which makes high quality travel gear uh, it makes a lot of tripods and one of this tripod range is this x go range so in the x go range the the company name is photo pro the range of tripod is x go and i guess in that x go there have there are many variants this one is the smallest one this is a proper travel tripod so why is this a travel tripod you can see the profile is very small compared to this big ass one right you can see and i can actually make this even more smaller let me show you how i can take these legs and i can invert them upwards making it even more smaller so now this is the smallest that it can go i think it is about 30 cm a little more than 30 cm i guess 45 cm uh, you guys can see it on the screen let me just check it once yeah it goes about 45 cm which is like uh, even smaller than my hand and now if i compare it side by side with this big wheel you can see the difference now it also has a lot of weight to it you know don't think that it is very lightweight because it is completely metallic and the reason why i am comparing this with this you might think it is unfair but the reason why i am comparing it is because this also goes to a very high height 
when it is completely unfolded right so when i put it on a desk like this and if i extend it out all out it will go to a height of around 4.5 feet now this one goes to 5.5 feet and this one goes to 4.5 feet which is definitely more than what you think that it would go from this tiny structure right so it has a very tiny profile but it can be extended out to a lot of height and you know the way you loosen out its legs is by this locking mechanism which goes in circles and you can go all the way till four or five extensions and then you can reach that height i'll show you some b-roll of how to unfold this now this travel tripod is having a lot more features than what i am actually talking about right now it has this panning ball head so i can loosen this knob over here this is that knob if i loosen this i can do a left to right smooth pan my phone or dslr or whatever thing goes over here it also has a ball head which i can loosen it and you know i can do the swiveling of the entire upper body it has this arca swiss mounting plate so arca swiss is a standard mounting plate which can you know i can remove this mounting plate and put it on other tripods which are also arca swiss compatible so there's that the compatibility is there which is a universal standard again another thing is you know you can put some weight onto this there is a hook over here at the bottom i don't know if you can see in the video but i'll show a close up over here the next thing is a very unique feature since this is a travel tripod and in case uh, if you have it unfolded but now you want a monopod right now you just want a selfie stick this one entire leg can be removed out you know can be unscrewed like this so this one entire leg comes out and now this tripod is now unusable of course but you can use this as a monopod so this out upper extension this entire ball head also comes out so i've removed the ball head i have the monopod now all i have to do is attach it to the monopod and then again make that attachment over here and now i have just completely transformed my travel tripod this photo pro x gecko the the model name is gecko into this crazy monopod which can now be extended to a huge level it has these four extensions right so if i unscrew all of them together you can see this is how much i can actually extend this so in case if i'm vlogging and i want a very high angle shot like this you know it it's not even fitting in the frame right i can do this kind of vlogging so my phone will be over here or camera system would be over here and this is the length of the monopod now that i have and i can take those top shots like kind of like drones so this is crazy right and then i can quickly fold them back tighten it up and attach it back to the tripod in case if i want the tripod mode so this is clearly a very versatile and i plan to do a review on this travel tripod i really am liking this but i still haven't used it extensively i have to take it on travel trips and you know make the most of all the features and then i can give you my opinions about this but my initial impressions and thoughts are really positive this is a very versatile tripod it can also be used in 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 your home as your photography or videography tripod because as i said it comes at a height of 4.5 ft and if you're doing sitting videos 4.5 ft is more than enough if you're very tall and if you want it at your eye level if you're 6 ft then you can always add a attachment like uh, like this attachment rod on top of the on top of this tripod you know that would extend its height even more it will give one or two foot more and then you can uh, take it at your eye level right but yeah these were all the different tripods and i have seven of them and one last addition is in case if you are not interested in tripods and you are only interested in something that is a selfie stick which holds just phones then there are selfie sticks which come with these phone holder mounts so they only have phone attachments the, you cannot remove this off so there is a limitation and then they also turn into a selfie stick as well as a tripod right but the drawback here is as i said they can only hold smartphones because they come with a built in attachment 
some of them might be removable i don't know but in case if you are in the market of looking for a tripod slash selfie stick which will hold only your smartphone and not other devices you don't own a gopro or a dslr then you can go for this kind of selfie stick slash tripod as well again links in the video description okay so this was the entire big video complete comparison between all the different tripods um which tripod is su uh, suitable for what particular situation so quickly giving you a summary if you are doing home videos mostly if you are doing videos which are uh, stationary in a proper studio or at your home and you just want to sit and make videos like this one then go ahead with this big one this will not disappoint i have been using it for couple of years now and it is very strongly built if you are doing a lot of vlogging if you are always on the go if you want compact tabletop tripods which can also be converted into selfie sticks then these two are the one for you but if you are also going a lot of camping off roading and places where you know the surface is not rugged then you can always go for this flexible tripod this gorilla pod kind of thing so i usually have both of these in my backpack and now this third tripod which is the travel tripod is always also going to be there that is because it has this very low profile tiny profile easily you know travel friendly i can just fold it it, it has this small carrying case uh, which you can put this tripod in and you can carry it it's it's a sling kind of bag so that's amazing as well so i'm going to be carrying three tripods at least on my travel trips um maybe four and i i i know i know i know i love tripods all right so this was the entire review and comparison of all the different tripods let me know which tripod is best suitable for you in the comments if you have any queries you can put them in the comment section again you guys can check out all the tripods by going through the links in the video description in case if you want to do a purchase and yeah this is a big video i know and if you've made it so far and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up let me know in the comments how this video was do share it with your friends maybe even they will find this helpful and make a right purchase decision and with that being said this is tanmay sakpal signing off see you in the next one peace